Well, welcome to another Turner's Tales. I've called with Sophie to see our brand new porcupines, which are absolutely amazing. Yeah. Sophie, <laughs> tell us a little bit about the porcupines. Uh, so these two are prehensile tail porcupines, and they're both girls. Uh, we've got Pumpkin, who's closest to us, and then Squash, who's one further away. Um, yeah. So why are we named them Pumpkin and Squash? Um, so most of our porcupines are named after vegetables. They are so cute, they it's are. amazing. <laughs> they are. And obviously prehensile tail porcupines mm -hmm. uh, because of the tail, which yep. they can obviously wrap around their trees to hang on to. They can, yeah. But it's these, it's the, it's the nose. <laughs> it's just like amazing. They do. They have amazing sense of smell, and you sort of, yeah, if you waft the food in front of them, they'll just follow it with their nose. So what do you like about them? Oh, I think they're just so unusual. You don't really see any animal that looks like them. They look really strange, and uh, yeah, they're just, they're lovely. They're really, really sweet. So obviously we're in this little room at the moment, but they've obviously got the outside bit. Yep. So this area we're in was the old butterfly house. Is, yep. So this is their new area for yeah, people to come and see them. Yeah. So they're looking great. Are they getting on all right and everything's yeah. fine? Yeah, they're getting on really, really well. They love just exploring and climbing. Um, yeah, they're very mischievous, these ones. So. Whereabouts in the country do they come from? Uh, so they're from Northern South America. Um, and they'll just live in forests. Um, basically stay up the trees most of the time, um, away from predators. And natural food they eat? Uh, beef fruits, lots of seeds and nuts and also chew bits of bark as well so we've got lots of hazel willow around so they can gnaw on. It's absolutely amazing. Reasonably warm in here so they like, like, like it needs to be warm, it's not like yeah. a tropical house but it's quite warm and obviously you can go up the branches out the tunnel yeah. and across into their big outside area. Yeah, I'm sure, yeah. Now two girls, Yeah, two girls. Um, I've never seen them in any other collection so presumably there's not many collections in Britain which keep these. No, I think there's only two, including us. So yeah, they are quite quite unusual, quite rare in the UK to come and see. As I say, both females. Mm -hmm. So is there a plan later on in stage maybe to get a male in? I think maybe, yeah. I think it would just, yeah. We'll have to see what we can find, hopefully find. Uh, so it's a long process, but these two are settling in really great at the minute. Yeah, yeah, they're getting on very well. Just... well that's, thank you, Sophie. That's, that's brilliant. Great You're to welcome. get up and close to meet them. Well that's it for another Turner's Tales, hope you enjoyed seeing the porcupines. If you'd like to come and see these lovely creatures, come to the new animal exhibit in Animal Adventure. <laughs>